Welcome back to Fabric. My mind is still a little bit melted from last time. That was a very, very uh, mentally taxing episode. Lots of, lots of thinking. This is a much more complicated game than I thought it would be. But let's try and keep going and get a few more levels done. And there's the key right away. So let's, ah, we can walk out here. And now we have gravity again. Oh yeah, we can like walk around in different chambers and stuff. Oh, and then like click here and then run out again and bend that way and stuff. I see. So I guess we'll just prime this to begin with just to like, because why not? And yeah, that's over here. We can bend those together. Oh, and that gives us a staircase, I see. Also, can't I do something weird where I do, like, this? Oh, God. Wait, where, where's the exit? The exit is... Wait. Where am I? Yeah, I'm... Okay, so this is flipped. And the exit is right there. Is there a key block in this level? Oh, right. Yeah, we, we saw it before. Key block is right in here. But I'm... Yeah, I can, like, drop into the key block, can't I? Just right here? Yep. Um, yeah, I don't think you're meant to do this at all. I might be screwed now, though. This might be impossible to get out of. Because, yeah, you're clearly not... Oh, no, it's not, because we can cheat. Um... And then get in here. And now... Where are we, exactly? I don't know where I am. This is, like, not the start. Oh? Well, this is something. Oh, I can do a thing here. Th was this intentional? This doesn't feel intentional to, like, use the, uh... Oh, no, not like that. Wait, I want to do... Oh, it is this one. Yeah, okay. So I want to hit that. And then go all the way out here. And now we can bend them together. Does that do anything? It does. Um. I think I might have to switch gravity again. Once again, I think I might be able to do it on, like, the edge here. There we go! Oh dear. And then we can just unbend, because now I'm like on the outside. Right? Wait, where where am I? Ah. Oh, so I kinda wait, I kinda wanna be on this gravity, but now I can't get up. I kinda screwed it, I think. I'll just drop down again. Let's flip up this way instead. I am... I don't know what I'm doing. This is just a bit weird. This is where I started, yeah. Wait, so can't I just, like, walk into the, uh... The exit now? If I go do this stuff again? What was that yellow? Right there. Oh! Oh, you were just meant to get to the key block. Okay, so I didn't really break anything. But then, how do we get to the... Where am I? I wish there was, like, a binding to find your own position when you're in here. Okay, so we need to get up here. And to do that, we need to, like, 
Um, well, we just need to compress it, really. Would also be uh, nice if there was like a hotkey, like holding down right... Oh! Oh, right click is reset position, but that's not... It doesn't reset to where you are, which is a bit annoying. There should be a, a bind where if you like... Yeah, I don't know. Press tab or middle mouse or something, then it would fade out. Or maybe if you scroll, if you scroll down, you lower the transparency of all gray blocks and leave only the colored ones so you can like see what you're trying to do. That would be kind of neat. Okay, let's jump back down here and see if I can do this instead. Oh! Uh, okay! Alright, I guess that was... it was as simple as that. That was odd. Log 33. The log went on. They advanced the civilization by countless aeons. The universe had become a fool rather than a mystery to solve. Oh, tool, not fool. You foolish universe. Oh, and here's another level where the worms are just awful. So I'm just going to turn them off. Yeah, it's a bit odd. Is this like an intermission again? Because it seems like the intermission levels have really bad performance because of like an overabundance of worms. Yeah, it seems like that's what's happening. And yeah, you can press these together and it like unblocks the exit. Huh. Advanced indeed, says Log34. The ways they had leashed the space-time were all astonishing. And now we get the worms back. And it's fine. Yep. Almost always. Oh, God! What is going on here? Oh, this is unpowered, so we can't use the red block until we find the power switch. I see. I guess I'll, I'll just, like, look at the map quickly. Man, I wish you could turn off this flashing. I need to check if that was even a problem in previous episodes. And yeah, this is just like a tutorial level. Ah, I see. So that's a power block. And it's like the connection is uh, is cut off. So we need to bend these together to connect it up. And then it'll power the block. Yeah, that makes sense. Cool. New mechanic. Wait, I just don't remember that being an issue in... Uh, earlier episodes, but maybe I just wasn't paying attention that it was flashing so much. 35. Even though only a fraction of what they had built was left, that was more than enough to bar my path. Oh my god. Power lines everywhere. And then, of course, if you, like, do this, you cut off the power. Yeah. I see. Holy shit! Oh, okay. Alright, so... There's, like, ground that gets powered as well. Yeah, this is powered ground, so now we can walk on it. But if this gets cut off, you can't walk on it anymore. No, oh, that doesn't really help me. I should look around for stuff to bend. It's just two red blocks. Yeah. Well, okay. In that case, that's a pretty simple level. Like, the only thing we can do is... Oh! Fall down. Is uh, perform one bend and unbend. And we have to just manage with that. Wait, can I... Okay, I just wanted to see if it, like, unpowered after the bend was done, or just immediately, and it's immediately. But yeah, we can just get over here, and now unbend, and then jump over here. And then we do want to cut it off, because then we unpower this and can walk through it. Cool. And then we do it one more time. Yeah, this is, this is neat. Green block, key block. And we head back. Very interesting mechanics.
I just wish you could uh, bend and unbend a bit quicker, because it takes a while. Like, you can't just, like, bam, bam. Bam, bam. No, the strafe jump killed me. God. That's a lot of bends. Yeah, if you strafe jump, this is a pure strafe jump. Jesus, look at that. There's, like, there's no... You can't even jump- oh my god, okay, you can just barely jump one block if you're strafing. That's just insane! And then you can jump, like, three blocks? When you're, uh, just running normally. Good god. Wait. Wait! Huh? It saved my- Oh! That's what the green block is! It's not a secret, it's a save point, or a checkpoint in the level! So now, if we jump off, I'll be back to the exact progress in the level that I was at when I hit the green block. Oh my god. We figured it out. I see. Huh. Well, that explains it. Oh, yeah, like that. I clicked it, but it hadn't, like, fully loaded, so you couldn't... Or, I, I don't know, I could do it there really quickly, but... Yeah, like there. I just, I couldn't click it for some reason. And again, twice in a row, it just doesn't work. Oh, what, what am I doing? Wait. Oh, I, damn it, I hit the green block before I hit the, the blue block. So I didn't activate the exit, so I need to, like... I can do... This? And now it's active, then I green block, and now if I jump off... The blue block should be active, or uh, the exit should be open. Yeah, so you can just hit it as many times as you want to keep saving your progress as long as you can get to it. Interesting, very interesting. Alright, this time I won't fuck up. No more strafing. There we go. Log entry 36. But obstacles are meant to be overcome, aren't they? I never had imagined a journey without a challenge. Sure. More powered floor. Ah, and I want to link that up. I see. But if I do, it cuts off power, doesn't it? Maybe it doesn't. It seems like that's the only thing I can really do. I have to link this up and this one. Okay, it didn't cut off power. I thought it would. And there's the exit, but I can't really... But it's not useful yet, because I need to find the key block, which is right there. Oh, I see. Okay, hold on. That shouldn't be bad at all. Wait, this seems incredibly easy. There must be a catch I'm not seeing. Because otherwise, you just do this. Oh, that's the catch. Yeah, I see. So you unbend, and now you can get over here, and then unbend again. And there we go. But now I have to bend these two together, but I can't, so I have to... Oh, right. I have to go over here to begin with. And then this is... Ah, unpowered. I see. Yeah, this is a bit trickier. Oh, but I can have these two linked. And now I hit that, and then I walk over here so I'm not within the radius. And now we power it. Yeah. So this whole thing was, like, pointless. I guess that's just... If you get here, and then you unpower... I guess I can do that. Just to show you, then, like, oh, no, I can't get back. But then you can actually get up here. It's like a one-way path to get back to the start and continue the level. Which is kind, because many other levels haven't had that kindness to them. 37. The log went on. The existence to all its... What? To all its very being was theirs. Huh? Both its rise and downfall. 
to all its very being was there's both its rise and downfall. What the hell? Unpowered red block. Link up there, I see. And this I can't really do much with right now. But I can link up these two. And then I can get over here. And now I can link them up. And I guess unbend again. And then those? Can I... No, I can't do that. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Oh yeah, I can do that here, yeah. Oh, well, then I have to step onto here. Get the key block. Then get over here. And unbend again. Bend over this way. Now we're back to the start. And from the start, I can quite easily make it back over here. Just by doing... Wait, what was it? These two. That. Jump over this way. Unbend. Then link up these two. Pretty simple level. I think we're nearing the end. Wasn't there only like 50 or 60 levels? 38! I mean, I guess that's like halfway. A little bit over. As I had known, it had come to combine what I had learned before. Like, it was time. They mean. Green block. Save block. Not so... jeez. Not secret block. Just a save block. Hey, I can do that! And I can jump down here! And this is a bit odd. And I can link all these together if I want to. But yeah, you're meant to like... Wait, is that actually... If I link these two up, this will get powered? Yeah. So that's how that works. And I can actually link this up, like so. And one more step if I want to. Oh man, where am I gonna end up now? Oh man! Oh man, what am I doing? Um... Well, I'm back at the start. Where is the key block? Where am I trying to get to? I think up here, probably? No? Is there a key block? I thought there was. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Wait, so I, I can just walk over here. Which, again, probably not the intended way. Hey, I'm there. But now, though, maybe because I... Oh! Um... Hmm... Yeah, I need that to be powered on, or I'll just fall through. Doing that powers it on, I see. I think I just, like, skipped a step at some point. So now we can go over and save, just to make sure I don't lose the progress. Save point. And now... wait, no. Now we just go over here, and we stand here, and then we unbend, because we want to, like, flip over this way. Well, I guess it doesn't really... we kind of want it to be powered. And to do that, we combine these two. There we go. And then we flip down and walk to the exit. Great! I probably cheated! 
I'm gonna be cheating a lot, I guess. When it's just like, my cheaty way makes more sense to me than the intended solution. 39. Following the lines being the easy part. Oh, following the lines being the easy part, the true riddle was to hold a grasp on cause and effect. Makes sense. What power lines do what? And breaking different power lines and stuff like that. Is there a key block? Nope, no key block this time. We just need to get to the exit. But I can't just like get there right away. I need I need to break this connection. And where do I do that? I only have three blocks to work with, right? There's no more blocks. Oh no. Oh, there's a whole other set. Okay. So it's like, we want to have this line active, but these two lines turned off in order to get to the exit. I see. Can't I just do that by, uh... Ah, uh, no, not really. If I bend this together, that breaks the one I don't want broken. But wait. Yeah, I can link over here. That turns all of them off. But that might be a good idea, because I can now, like, get in here and then unbend and walk across. But I might not be able to... No, I can't see anything else at this point, so that doesn't work. But hang on! Can't I just do... What I did before then? That! And then I bend it over here. Now we can just walk over this way, unbend, and that's still unbent. Or, well, bent. That's inactive. Was that... was that intended? God damn it, I don't know. I don't fucking know if I'm doing things wrong. But I'm progressing, so clearly I'm doing something right. Log 40. It was not as hard as it looked initially at times. I had one eye on shortcuts. I really did. I really did have shortcuts. Lots of them. Well, to make up for last episode, I think I'll just end it here, and we'll continue on in Fabric next time, once more. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye!